Here at Dying Technologies, we need to ensure that any film forming foam forms a film. An example of a way to test this is to actually place a solution onto a fuel. The amount of fluorochemical in the foam solution directly affects the foam's ability to form a film by lowering the surface tension of the solution. In this demo, the fuel is cyclohexane and the screw is used to slowly disperse the foam solution. On the left, the foam solution forms a film spreading from left to right across the dish very quickly, forming a barrier that protects the fuel from ignition. On the right, the foam solution does not form this film and leaves the fuel exposed. To help assist you in seeing the film, a larger amount of concentrate was placed onto the cyclohexane in this rough film. Whether or not the film is sealed over the fuel becomes very apparent when an ignition source is introduced. Without a film, the fuel ignites quickly. A solution that forms a strong film, like the solution on the left, will quickly reseal even when physically broken. Surface and interfacial tension are also used when necessary to obtain a more accurate numerical result. In surface and interfacial testing, a ring is used to measure the tension between the air or fuel. This tension is visually noticeable. If the tension is low enough, the solution will form a film.